Hello viewers, in this session we are going to discuss what are the solutions for exercise 3. The difference between largest and smallest observations in data is that is called mean. So mean always, mean will take all these sum of observations divided by total number of total observations so it will take formula this one sum of observations by total observations but what this idea is difference between largest and smallest it will not consider the difference between largest and smallest so for that it is false our second one so what is our second one is in a bar graph the bar graph which has greater length may contain more. So let's take bar graph like this. So here maybe 4, 2, 1, 1 like that. So here what is its A is mode. So any item will be repeated 4 times means yes we can take the stars mode. So that is true. Next our third one is value of every observation in the data set is taken into account when median is calculated so value of every observation while calculating median will not take all the values so here in median what we will take is only middle value middle value will take will not consider about first and last values that is also false or fourth one value of every observation sorry the median of set of numbers is always one of the numbers so median always so they are telling that one two three four five five like that then median means be three so it is in this case it is three so what is the next case so median they are setting one two three four five six then we need to take average of this so 3 by 3 plus 4 by 2 that is 7 by 2 that is 3.5 will get so in this case median is 3.5 in this case it fails so that is also false our next given as seven households in a village are 1200 1500 1400 1000 again 1000 1600 again 10000 so they are given that one what is our first one is they are asked us find the median income of the households median they are asked median so median they are asked what is meant by median is middle value middle value so first before going to that what we have to write is the given values we have to write it in ascending order ascending order from lowest to highest we have to write so ascending order we are going to write first thousand then thousand two thousands are cancelled then one thousand two hundred then one thousand four hundred then one thousand five hundred then one thousand six hundred then ten thousands so middle value what is that middle value is now we have to check so first one last one cancelled then second one last one second third first three last three if you cancel means you will get median is 1400 middle value first three last three we are lived after that middle value is 1400 then what is next one second one if one more households with the monthly income 1500 is added then median income will be so write in add it 1500 is added then what is the median we have to write it in ascending order so what is that is 1000 1000 1200 then 1400 then 1500 1500 1600 then 10000 sorry for that so then 10000 so here what is this is we have to take first first one last one first one last one so here first and last so we are really, we are getting these two are what is that 1400 and 1500 are middle values 
middle values we are leaving so what is that what we have to read so for median is for calculating median of two middle values is average of the two values so 1400 1500 by 2 so what is that is 1400 1000 2900 by 2 so what we'll get is 2 ones are 2 2 fours are 8 2 fives are 10 and 0 so 1450 is the median so after adding sorry median will be 1450s answer thanks for watching next our third question is so what is our third question they are given observations of data are what they are given 16 72 then 0 55 65 55 then 10 and 41 chaitanya calculated the mode and median without taking zero into consideration did chaitanya do the right thing so without taking zero as consideration chaitanya calculated something value so so for mode zero means that is nothing zero means it will not continue there is nothing mode means there is nothing mode nothing means it's not repeated so what you can write is no repeating no repeating of no repeating anything then mode okay mode we can calculate it without zero consideration but median we have to median zero will consider median zero will consider so that's not way mode you can calculate but zero we have to take care then fourth one how many distinct set of three positive integers have mean median mean will be six median will be seven and no mode no mode so no mode so for that what we have to calculate is for that no mode so what we can write is median means middle value first one second one third one median will be seven for that six seven and six seven median and positive integers mean will be six and median will be seven no mode so three means mean will be equal to sum of integers by number of integers sum of integers will be we don't know what is that x first number x1 plus x2 plus x3 three numbers by 3 into 6 so what is that the mean will be 6 then sum of numbers will be three numbers will be 18 so if you add three numbers we should get 18 so that is 1 plus 2 x1 x2 x3 x2 plus x3 will be equal to 18 so 1 7 then here 10 then 2 take 2 9 then what are the repetition values for this so what are the repetition value for this 1 7 10 2 7 9 3 7 8 4 7 7 no mode repetition right for that 7 will not come so this is not case 477 seven will not come why because no mode then 5 7 6 